Chris, look in the sky. Look, it's another drone. Because they're everywhere now. Drones have been projected to be a multi-billion dollar industry. That inspires innovation. And innovation is a good thing for the most part, but sometimes it leads to really strange things when your brother and your friend and your cousin are making stuff too. That is what it has inspired today's list. These people are making the craziest, weirdest things, and we have found some of them. Welcome to the top five strangest drones. Number five, we have the NASA X-43. This drone made the list for one reason, and one reason alone, speed. I have a thing for speed, I like fast stuff, and it doesn't get much faster than this. Mach 9.2, AKA 7,000 miles per hour which is insanely fast. It is actually the fastest thing to ever move within Earth's atmosphere, and it was a drone. What makes it strange is that they actually made three of them, and each one of them was only a one-time thing. Like, they flew it, and like, yeah, look how fast it is. What are we gonna do with it? We don't know, but guess what? It's super fast. This drone was made for research purposes to look at hypersonic flight. But what I really like about it is that it went 7,000 miles an hour, and it technically is considered a drone and it crashed into the ocean because everything that moves that fast has to be cooled down by water, apparently, or whatever. It makes the list at number five because it is so fast, it is a drone, and it's dope. Number four, we have Intelligent Energy's hydrogen drone. Yes, we now have drones powered by hydrogen energy. If you fly drones, you know typical batteries now only power a drone for somewhere between 20 and at the most 40 minutes. So if you have a drone that can fly for three hours, there's a lot of industrial as well as delivery as well as whatever the hell you can imagine kind of applications for being able to keep something in the air for that long. Welcome to the list, number four, Intelligent Energy's hydrogen powered drone. Number three, we have the Splash Drone. It's funny because I feel like just by telling you the title of the drone, you pretty much know everything I'm about to tell you about what it does. The Splash Drone is a drone that is completely waterproof. This thing is able to take off from the water. It is able to do autonomous flights, blah, blah, blah. What it really comes down to is this drone is actually meant to be used with rescue crews. If you're like a part of the Coast Guard or part of the, you know, the Whale Watch crew, this drone is able to fly over oceans or any kind of water, whether it deliver an incredibly small payload of something or be able to locate someone that is lost in the ocean. This drone can do all of that. It flies autonomously, it flies with an RC, and it's just really cool because it's really the only drone that is actually able to be purchased at the moment that can fly and be completely submerged in any kind of water. So that's why I made the list number three because that is really strange. You have a crap ton of electronics running something that flies in the air and it still is completely waterproof. Number two, we have the Ehang 184. The Ehang is a personal drone. And when I say a personal drone, that means that it can fly somebody up to, I think, 230 pounds. 230 pound human being can be flown from point A to point B as long as it takes only about 20 to 30 minutes to do that flight. It's literally, hey look, iPad tablet with Google Maps. Here's where I wanna go, and it does like a U. It goes up, over, and down. And I guess that'd be an inverted U. But either way, an inverted U, and that's all it does is go from point A to point B. The funniest part about this whole drone is that it is the most illegal thing ever. There isn't a country on earth that is allowing for this drone to be flown at the moment. And that's what E-Hang's hang up is. <laughs> I couldn't help that, I'm sorry. Either way, I think it's cool, I think it's ambitious, I think it's strange. And that's why it makes number two on the list. Number one, we have the Crossblade Aerospace System Sky Prowler. This drone is a fixed wing quadcopter drone. Yeah, I said that correctly. It has wings like a plane, and flies like an eagle everywhere it wants to go. Technically, it's a hexacopter because it has four blades pointing up, as you can see. There's four blades pointing up, and then there's two on the back that propel it. It doesn't come with a camera, it doesn't come with any of that, but it's really customizable. You can take the nose off of it and turn that into a GoPro gimbal status thing. It's really versatile. It can go really fast, 65 miles an hour with the wings on it, 35 miles an hour without the wings, which is pretty much standard for a quadcopter. The biggest thing that makes it strange is it kind of covers both bases of what a drone pilot would want when it comes to a fixed wing and a quadcopter, which I can't imagine why they'd overlap ever why you'd ever need to have a fixed wing quadcopter. I just don't know. Congratulations to the Crossblade Aerospace Systems Prowler as being the number one on the strangest of the strange drones. We actually have an honorable mention on this list and it is the Zero Zero Robotics Hover. You probably never heard of Zero Zero Robotics because this is actually their very first product. This is the first thing they've ever put out. What it is is a really strange drone that you just open up and it just hovers. 
and it takes 4K footage in 16 megapixel, 13 or 16, I don't know. It takes really high megapixel images of you. It does the uh, face recognition and body recognition. And if you just put it out in front of you, it'll recognize you and it'll just follow you wherever you go. And the other really cool thing about this is that it doesn't even have a gimbal on it. It just has internal image stabilization. For someone like me as a YouTuber, or somebody that does things that require them to be on video. This drone is pretty cool. That is strange enough to make it to an honorable mention on our top five list. Welcome to the game Zero Zero Robotics. Droners, thank you again for watching the video. And if you'd like to see more videos that are list like and researched to the dopeness, you can click right here. And if you wanna just see more drone related videos that I'm involved in, because obviously me involved means the drone videos are great, you can click right there. Either way, I need you to go ahead and click the subscribe button and do what you always do and stay fly.